Hello, everybody. Sorry, this is quick, and different, because I wasn't planning to do this, but this kind of got thrust upon me because of what some other people were doing. So I'm still in my face that I'd painted on uh, Save Robbie's channel. You know, some people were trying to make fun. Even amongst those same people can't manage to put anything else on their face other than powder, eyeliner, and maybe a little lipstick. We'll see how this turns out under the lights in the thumbnail. Anyway. You're going to hear my furnace. It's going to kick off in a little bit. I wrote down what I'm going to say. That doesn't mean I don't mean what I'm saying. First off, I want to thank Case Discussion for having me on our panel last night. I really appreciate it. I didn't come on here because I don't have any mods. <laughs> so we did talk about it beforehand, and several people did ask, and she was one of them I talked about. We talked about having me on, and she's the one I picked. May appear on some others, but that'll be down the road. I want to thank everybody for watching. It's nearly 3,000 people so far. That probably ruffles some feathers. I know it ruffles some feathers. No one's been able to refute anything I said so far. All they've been able to do is launch some personal attacks and make some fun. I'll be waiting. I fully intend to use this channel. My recording equipment is scheduled to be here tomorrow. I may do some makeup content, but the makeup community is huge. I mean, what's a guy in his 40s going to add to that? Probably not much. So we'll see. I'll do some of these recorded videos like this when I need to. Live streams will probably happen here and then once I have mods. As for me, I'll appear on live streams and of course I'll be in chats. I said I want peace with everyone and I mean it. I intend to continue to prove that through my actions. I am embarrassed by how I acted on Natasha Cooper's panel. I know not everyone will accept the apologies that I make. But I still intend to try. The change that I'm making doesn't depend on everyone else's acceptance. Now, as far as apologies go, there are two people I may never get to talk to face to face in a chat on or on a panel or even up by phone call or anyone else so i hope that someone out there will point them to this mommy ramblings i know you'll never likely never let me on your panel But I need to publicly apologize to you for making light of everything that has sprung from your very real pain caused by a tragedy no one should have to go through in losing a child. 
there are no excuses to justify it. It was wrong. I hope at some point you can forgive me and also that you can take time for yourself to finish working through your grief. I am sorry for what I did. Lufa. I only ever thought of you as a friend, even when we argued. I apologize for trying to assist you when Will implied in an interview that he might sue you instead of simply letting you know and letting you handle it. That caused a cascade of consequences that is still continuing. I also apologize for confronting you in J is for Justice's chat. Natasha Cooper told me what we, you were saying there in badmouthing her, knowing that I would come to confront you, even after claiming that she needed no defense. But I don't want to fight with you anymore. It pulls all of our friends, all of our former friends, and the entire community in different directions. Plus, I don't want to see you hurt anymore, at least not by me. I know you may never accept this, but I at least wanted to try. Like I said, I want nothing but peace. I would even like peace with Natasha Cooper. But considering her actions over the past nine days now, she doesn't want peace with anyone. Myself included. And I ask everyone to consider my behavior since my interview compared to hers. I remember when Natasha did true crime, and she was good. I remember when she was bringing awareness to missing children's cases across all 50 states. Were the rest of the children found? I would suggest that she's lost herself. In drama and ridicule instead of concentrating on what she claims brought her to YouTube.
That is all I have to say. Thank you all for listening.